There might soon be a big change to New Mexico's birth certificates. A bill would give people the option to identify themselves as male, female, or transgender. News 13's Rachel Knapp is live at the Roundhouse this evening with more. Rachel. Dean, one of the bill's sponsors says that this is one way to modernize our state and to help transgender people legally identify themselves the way that they want to. And when we, as a state, put up these barriers thinking that we know better, that we know best, and that we have the, the right and the role to dictate to people who they truly are, we know that causes significant harm to transgender folks, to their mental health, and to their general health. Senator Jacob Condelaria is one of the sponsors of Senate Bill 20, which would allow someone to change their gender identity to male, female, or use the letter X, meaning an undesignated or gender other than male or female. The bill would no longer require people to prove that they've gone through surgery to change the gender marker on their birth certificate. The senator says the bill would give transgender people more freedom to be themselves. I believe it's a fundamental right for every person to be respected and recognized for who they are, and the state should afford them the same dignity it affords to every other person. It was passed at the Senate Public Affairs Committee with a few wording changes to the bill, and it just passed at the Senate Judiciary Committee, so it'll now head to the floor for a vote. Dean. All right, Rachel, thank you. That bill passed along party lines at the Senate Judiciary Committee. Republicans on that committee declined to comment.